One of the most frequent complaints from the Linux community is that we have too many distros and that we especially have too many distros that are essentially the same thing. You especially hear this complaint regarding Debian based distros because there's like hundreds of Debian based distros out there, right? There's so many distros that base on Debian because Debian is a great base to base your distribution on. The same thing with Arch. There's so many Arch based distributions and you hear people say that all of these distributions are the same thing. The Debian distributions, what's the difference between MX Linux and Linux Lite and Zoran and yada, yada, yada. And the Arch based distros, is there a real difference between Arco Linux and Garuda and Endeavor, aren't they under the hood essentially all the same thing? And these people that complain, yes, they have a point, but at the same time, I also think they're missing the point. This morning, I made me a cup of coffee. I'm sitting here drinking a cup of coffee, and I wanted something sweet to go with my black cup of coffee. And I keep some hostess cupcakes and, and things around. So today I was trying to decide what to go with my coffee. Did I want a ding dong? Or did I want a zinger? And for those of you that are not familiar with Hostess cupcake products, ding dongs and zingers, they're essentially the same thing, right? They're this uh, like chocolate cake with some chocolate icing with a white creamy filling in the center. They're just different shapes, right? A ding dong is more like a disc hockey puck shape where the zinger, of course, is shaped more like a well, really, the zinger should be called a ding dong and the ding dong probably should be called a zinger. But you get the point. Essentially, they're the exact same cake, right? They're the exact same cake. They're just shaped differently. But some days I have to admit, some days I want a ding dong. Some days I want a zinger. And there's at least two other Hostess products that are very similar to both ding dongs and zingers. The Hostess cupcakes, they're essentially the same thing. They're a black cake with some icing on top and they've got a creamy filling very similar to the ding dong. It's practically the same product. And then you have the ho-hos, which are a black cake with some chocolate icing with a creamy filling, except it's swirled. It's kind of almost like a cinnamon roll kind of product but it's essentially all the same ingredients. Those four products are the same thing, just in a different package. But of course, if you are one of these people that you have a sweet tooth, you enjoy these kinds of cupcakes and, and you know, these desserts, and may maybe you even love some of these hostess products like I do. I I'm buying boxes of ding dongs all the time, right? And is there a real difference between these products? No, but you do some days prefer a zinger some days you prefer a ho-ho, right? <laughs> Even though fundamentally, yes, it's the same thing, but are they the same? No, not really. And the people that are calling for us to only have essentially one Debian distribution, you know, mother Debian, get rid of all the forks and the derivatives because there's just too many. We just need one distribution. The same thing with all the arch derivatives and arch forks. Get rid of them all. We only need one distribution. Well, that's like saying we'll, we'll keep zingers and we're going to get rid of Ding Dong's Hostess Cup cakes and ho-hos. Now, would you really want to live in a world without ho-hos? I know I wouldn't. So this is something to really think about. If you're one of these people out there that are saying there's too many Arch-based distributions, too many Debian-based distributions, too many distributions out there all doing the same thing, think about that. Would you want to live in a world where you all you got was this one Hostess cake product and the rest of the line disappeared? I don't think you would. I don't think you'd make that same argument. And at the end of the day, it doesn't matter if I run Ding Dong Distro and you run Zinger Linux, right? It doesn't matter. Even though fundamentally under the hood, they're the same thing. It doesn't matter. We can like different distributions. We can run different distributions. And just like all of those dessert products, when I go into the supermarket and I see an entire aisle full of, you know, cupcakes and related products like that, I love seeing that. And the same thing with Linux distributions, the more the merrier. I, I definitely don't want to see a dramatic drop off in Linux distributions. I think it's, it's healthy at the end of the day for us to have choice. So that's just a little food for thought. I'm going to finish my cup of coffee. Now, which one am I going to choose? The ding dong or the zinger? Take a guess in the comments down below. Peace, guys.